Good evening, big friends. Dan Foster here in Michigan. Uh, tonight, I'm going to try my first main crop Muscatel Prado fig. Um, I noticed a couple, they're not yellow jackets, they're little paper wasps, but they are hunting my fig, and I'm afraid if I don't eat it tonight, it won't be there tomorrow. So, again, this is Muscatel Prado, came from, uh, I believe, Nelson in uh, Canada and uh, it produces very large main crop figs as well as very large Breba figs. So very productive, very reliable, very tasty. It's uh, a great fig. Oh, there's a fly. I don't have wasps, I have flies. So um, I don't spray anything in, on my trees, so I, I could probably put a pyrethroid out and get rid of some of these things, but I, I don't like to do that. I don't wanna eat any of that stuff, so. Anyway, let's let's pick these two figs and plate them up, and we'll see what they taste like. Okay, I had to get up on a ladder. That one. There you go, you little bugger. took it and you're not getting it all right so we picked those two figs and put them on the scale all right we've got 133 grams uh, round that down to 132 66 grams a piece roughly and a couple of good looking figs there nice cracks kind of I guess like a purple red color to it some purple tinge to it tinges to it so really pretty fig and like I say lucky I got them before the paper wasp did so let's go ahead we're gonna plate these up cut them in half I'll take my pictures and we'll be right back to taste them Okay, we got the, the figs ready to eat out here. And uh, we are out here with our chickens. Our chickens might help us eat these. Um, so which one do you want? I'm gonna let you go first. I want that one. Take it, it's yours. Can <laughs> mm. we eat it? <laughs> yeah. Right now? You're gonna need to eat it, yeah. To do a taste test, we're gonna need to have you do that. Mm. It's really good. Really good. All right, I'll have the other half. I think that's the other half. Sweet. Not this red is what I remember, but. Mm. Oh, it's super good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's, they're not spoiled at all. Um, sweet. Yep. I wouldn't say that much berry flavor no. to it, but there's a lot of sweetness to it. Yep, a lot of sweetness. Okay, girls. There you go. Come here. They're going crazy. Don't fight over it. <laughs> here, you have the other one. Mmm, that is good. Yeah, it's very good. I'm kind of... There's a seed crunch to it. Yep. Um, but like I say, mostly sweet. Not a whole lot of berry. Would you say there's berry in there? No. no. Well, maybe nope. a little bit, but not a whole lot. But it's a pretty big, refreshing fig. Pretty fig. Um, medium. So. I like the skin. You know, I remember the Breba being better last year. So I think, and even I think I've written before that I think that the, the Breba is where this crop shines, although the main crop's good too. So. Lots of flavor. Lots Moscatel Prado, thanks for watching. Mm. Oh my God. Uh, she ran away with it. Look at it. They're all chasing her.